So welcome to my channel and welcome to the Jung Silong, which is a mega shopping complex here in Patong Beach, Phuket, Thailand. And uh, right now I'm actually in the place called the Bay or I just kind of like the centerpiece of this entire complex, which is full of nothing but shopping stores, places to eat. It's unbelievable. Now, the way this place is broke down is like this. You have the bay, which I'm in right now. Over there, we have the jungle. And then you swing it around. The garden. And then we swing it around, and you have this place called the uh, Botanica. So, we're gonna go check out, do a little exploring, and uh, see what it's like. So, shall we? Let's go. Now look at this centerpiece right by this fountain. See how cool this is. Wow. The first place we're going to go check out is called the jungle. So let's go. This is really cool, especially during the rainy season. It's a nice place to come and uh, hang out. There is so many stores here. It's unimaginable. So first stop, right here. Let's celebrate the new chapter of Jung Silong going in the jungle. So let's go. This is a, just kind of a little bit of a taste and it's got multiple floors inside. That's all I can say is wow. Kind of a walk around in like a little circle and see what they have. This is the uh, first floor. I don't think I'll hit every floor, but it'll give you an idea what it looks like. I mean, it really branches off into other little sections. Look how the uh, architecture is. You got ice cream place. Oh, look at this tuk tuk. That's neat. Look at this thing. Oh man, I haven't seen one of those in a while. Before I continue on more with the jungle, I'll show you exactly where I'm at. It's not far from Bangla Road, which is right over there. And this is a Rat Uthit Road. And it's very easy to park because they have a huge parking garage on the outside or down below. So I'm kind of giving you a, a west look at what's here. You see all the tuk-tuks waiting. Now this uh, shopping center complex actually went through a major uh, renovation, so it's actually even better than it was before. So I've been told. So back inside, 
we go to the jungle. That was just a quick look on the out, just a quick look from the west entrance. Now back inside. Okay, back inside. And you can see the uh, another overview of uh, what they have on this floor. And I'll quickly go to the second floor of this uh, jungle area. It really is something. If you like shopping, this is a uh, this is for you. It's pretty complex. Now, let's say we uh, head up to the second floor of this uh, place, and uh, to have uh, kind of direct you what's there. The jungle zone on the second floor. You get a good view from right up here. Look at that. I just love the architecture of this place. It's unbelievable. All types of uh, spa areas. Very easy to really get in depth with this uh, place. I won't cover every floor, just kind of the highlights. Let's see more second floor action of the jungle. And you know, because it's low season right now, there's really not a lot of folks here. High season, this place will really start picking up. Opens up at um, 11 o'clock. And it's right again in central Bataan. These uh, machines right here. It's crazy. So you can see there's a lot to do here. Get your hair done. Do this hair right here so you can get this. Get a fancy uh, braid put on your more uh, little games. That is uh, Time to leave the jungle and make my way to the garden. Another view. It's not really hard to get lost here. Just go to the central area where I'm headed. Actually, before we head to the garden, we're gonna go check out the jungle basement floor and look at this uh, food bazaar that should be interesting it is okay, down at the food bazaar look at these durians wow look at the size of this place here just kind of walk around you can see all the places there just so many places you can eat at it's unbelievable I'll just kind of walk down a little bit Look at them all. Every type of imagined cuisine you could think of is actually here. So this is... Wow. Unbelievable. This is really... I am totally impressed with what's here. They got a nice place to sit down and eat. So no shortage of uh, where you're gonna eat at. Uh, and they just the outside. That's all in bot by the way, so 100 baht. 
for what you're seeing on the uh, price. And luckily it's not that busy actually. Imagine during the uh, high season it really gets pretty crazy down here. And you can buy all this uh, dried fruit too. This is really good. The only problem is it's got a ton of sugar in it. If you got a sugar problem, just be wary of that. Let's see what's down here. Looks like it goes more into uh, shopping plus food. But that was the main food. So you can see how easy it is you can find your way around so they have like a banking zone which is on the b floor and technically i'm still in the jungle but i'm down below in the bazaar of mega food places to eat so uh, being made right here still in the jungle but you get some up close look at uh, food preparation And they have it down to a science. Okay, back out to the main area after seeing the food bazaar, which is right below the jungle. Now we're going to go check this other place out. It's called the garden. Next stop, the garden. So again, likely the same, full of little shops, restaurants. You got some games right here. But look at these columns right here with the flowers. Look at this. And you got some of the, uh, the way they designed it up there. Old Portuguese style. Place called Urban Food. Kind of reminds me of uh, if you've ever been to uh, Phuket Town. And actually uh, coming out to another entrance, which would more likely be the east entrance. So I'll come out here to the street and kind of show you. Now, I am very impressed with this whole Jung Si Long. It's actually an incredible place. loaded up with all types of nice places to eat. So again, another entrance to the back road. I would say, call it the east side. That being going down toward the southern end of Batong, and then if we wrap it around the north end. Okay, time to leave the garden and head back out to the main area to go in the uh, Botanica. So that's pretty cool. Saw the east entrance. I'd like to go up there, but I don't think I can. I think it's closed. Get a better view. That's okay. Maybe certain times of the year they uh, actually open that. But see, you can do these uh, virtual tours here. It's like 250 baht. So you put that on you, and you can uh, really have some fun. So back out to the centerpiece, I call. It's 
so far we've checked out the jungle right over here went up on all the way down oxy looked at the uh, food bazaar which is on the basement and then came along and saw the garden saw the east entrance now let's see we go check out the botanica come across this uh, little walk And I believe this uh, this has maybe about three floors on it. So you come in here, give you an idea what's here. This is uh, what's this place called the uh, Robinson Major Retailers here, Timberland. This part looks like probably the largest of the uh, three that I've been in. Look at all these watches. Now if you're looking for a deal, I don't think you're gonna find it here. These are all westernized prices. I know this is a lot to take in. Malls or shopping areas generally are. The last one I went to was um, UTC in La Jolla in San Diego, which was not even close to this one. This one is definitely more complex than uh, that one. And it's a good place to go for a rainy day or when you expect rain, which there is today. So, and I love making videos. I take a walk around before I hit the second floor of this place. This video might be a little bit longer than some of my normal videos, but I'll try to keep it maybe 40 minutes if you can stick it out that long. We even have a place called the G floor, but I don't know what's down there. We have a big C. That's a uh, franchise food mart here in Phuket. Probably Thailand in general. But look at this. That is a beautiful flower arrangement. So coming around the, uh, the other side before I hit the next floor. the Wawa -wa Cha. All right. Playboy. Okay, now I see a good escalator to uh, go up. I'll head up this way. Kind of make my way around. And you can see the Dried fruit is very popular around here and very good at that. Some more areas down here, but uh, I won't wander down there because it's make my way up stairs. Plenty of ATM machines. Okay, time to go up on the second floor. Tataka. And you get another view from up here. So when you go into each one of these sections, they kind of branch out. Without looking at a map on every little thing. I generally don't do shopping centers like this, but because of the rain and it's kind of exciting because I've never been in here it makes it a lot of fun got these uh, that goes on down further 
but take a walk around here a little bit. Okay, gonna make our way on another branch. Ah, oh, New Balance, my favorite <laughs> shoes. Marco Polo. Come around. Got a major uh, phone place, the big C again, that must be the upper floor. Buy yourself an electric bike. Look at all this. Man. You got all the prices on there. Again, it looks so pretty. The way they've uh, designed these chandeliers. That's a lot of beauty. So if you've made it this far in the video, please let me know in the comments what you think about this place. It's pretty incredible. I haven't even got to the third floor of this one. Third floor action. Looks a uh, little bit of cinema, a lot of games up here. Here's the uh, XD Theater. And here is the uh, SF Cinema. Let's see what's playing. See how fancy this is. Nice. Look at that popcorn, makes me hungry just looking at it. I think that's what's planned. A little around the side, a uh, trampoline park. Looks like it's not open though. Maybe it is, I don't know. Take a walk in there. I don't think so. I think it's kind of quiet here. All right, it's called Froggies. I like that name. But they're really into this, uh, you can get in this 3D experience. The mirror maze, oh, there I am. We got more game shops. Take a walk in here. All types. Bumper cars. Man, do they have a lot of toys in here. Look at all these machines. Got the shooting gallery right up here. Oh, I love foosball. Leaving the third floor, heading back to the main area. Okay, I ran into these folks here in the Junk Sea Line, and they are from the Junkyard Theater yeah. here. Is that and recording, sir? It is. Oh. It is recording. 
and uh, you're going to show me what's this junkyard all about anyway? It's a theater and uh, it's uh, like a parody. Yeah. yeah. Mayhem and then dancing. Yeah. Okay. T-boy. 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 Yeah. Sample. 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 You can. Oh, you can. Show. Okay. Give me a sample, man. I need to see a sample. All right. Stop. Fill up your and listen. Ooh, yeah. Oh man. Oh, that is awesome. Junkyard. Junkyard. Thank you very much. Well, this is the end of this video of my complete tour of the Jung Silong here in Batong Beach, Phuket, Thailand. This mega shopping restaurant hub. And I'm back here known as the Bay, which is the centerpiece of this entire complex. And I covered everything. I went to the jungle, which is over there, circled it around, did a good tour inside the garden, and then followed it up there in the uh, Botanica. So, Hope you enjoyed it, and if you like this content, please consider giving it a like. It really does help out my channel, and I hope to see you in my next video. So see you from beautiful Batong Beach, Phuket, Thailand. Later.